Welcome back, you guys, to another video, and today we're going to be, uh, going to... Excuse me, sir. You work here? No, I just hang around here for fun. Ha <laughs> ha, joking, I'm joking. How can I help you, friend? I know this sounds crazy. The Some toolbox. dumb old coot, I know, is telling me there's these houses you can buy pre-cut. <laughs> Not crazy, friend. The very latest in modern convenience. Convenient and cost-efficient. Which house do you want? Each one is entirely unique, but also the same. Excuse me? Perhaps I'm going too fast, sir. Do you want to buy a house? I think so. I'll give you a luxurious, entirely unique pre-cut palace. And if you order today, I guarantee you're home in a matter of weeks, maybe sooner. I'll take that one. Ah, uh -huh, yes, we have that one in stock. And I already got credit from the bank. Oh, fantastic. Now, you write your name here, and uh, you sign your name there, and you will be the proud owner of a factory-built home. It's that easy. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Martin. Albert Cakes Esquire at your service. Mr. Martin. You always give me a minute. <sighs> what are you doing here? Everything okay? I'm not sure. Probably. A fella came by the farm. Got attacked on the road. He said the Skinner brothers was hanging around. Lots of them. I left Uncle Arm to the teeth back at the ranch. Who are these two? Guns for hire. This Skinner's about. We need them. We ain't got that kind of money, Charles. You want to get robbed for your house? No, but... You're right. These Skinner's gonna be nasty. Come on. Mr. Devin, Guns for hire. Me. Mr. Wayne, this is... Milton. Jim Milton. Sir, good to meet you. We're gonna be heading up to the Manzanita Post. Why? The best smith around is that Norwegian fella up there. Yeah, so they say. You boys ready? Yes, sir, we're ready. Good, because you're about to get shot at over a goddamn hammer. You want to build a house with a sniper rifle, then? I know it deals <laughs> real well. I'll get you a good deal. Thank you, sir. <laughs> build it with All a right sniper then. rifle. Let's go buy us some tools. <laughs> Actually, that doesn't sound like a bad idea. I know the quickest way. Follow me. Then we're gonna start building the home. Was that ever really a thing, by the way, that you could just like buy a home pre-cut and whatnot? Like what they were just shown there. Like th that was actually possible at the time, or? or a I think a bit of both, for what it's worth. Cash is cash. So it was all the same to me. I saw you getting skittish there, but don't you worry. We're not getting shot at. Not oh, yet, anyway. Yeah. I know Charles Smith. If he's got cause to be concerned, it's usually good cause. You got a shotgun messenger sitting right beside you, all right? Now suppose you don't know much about robbing caravans. Well, not much, I guess. <laughs> no. Well, nor do I. But I know a thing or two about protecting them. And if a robber sees some strong men sitting up front, two of them guns for hire, then they're gonna wait for the next set of fools to come on through. Unless they take the guns to mean they're carrying something valuable. Instead of pre-cut timber and some tools. What? No. Wait, look, trust me on this. You are overthinking it. You hire a gun, you hire peace of mind and a deterrence. So I'll sit here looking big and scary, and you can concentrate on the horses. <sighs> All right. I'll do just that. Maybe I've done this kind of thing before, and maybe I can handle a weapon, but I'm not so different from you, partner. I think you might be. Hey, we're taking the next right up towards Manzanita Post. Tell me that again. People wonder how you can handle it, living by your gun. But it's the same as any other occupation, really. When I get home, I put my gun on the rack and it stays there. I mean it, it, it really stays there. Uh oh. <sighs> Why does this game always do this shit to me, man? I don't even think I was giving it. me a Lancaster my repeater. I don't I want that. I want my one. Evans repeater. Chopping wood, mending the roof, putting the kids to bed. Ah, screw it, man. I'm you can't win the them all, I guess. I got my gun at the ready. And I'm trying to make my employer as comfortable as possible. That's, uh, 
real good up here. You're in good hands. I know this country well. Good. Am I finally gonna meet this tool maker? Now, Niels, he's an acquired taste, but boy, can he work metal. Norwegian, you see? Viking blood. Fellas up there used to worship a god with a hammer. Guess I figures they'd still be making them. I'm not Norwegian, sure ah. Norwegian speaking, worships him with a hammer. Tools. Thor. This is the spot. Just up ahead. Okay. You boys wait here. After you, Mr. Milton. Nils, Nils. What did I say his name was? Nils? I don't know. I really wasn't paying that much attention. Nils, Nils it's me. Willard Wayne. Okay. This is my associate, Jim Milton. Okay. He heard you was the best. Best Smith around. Okay. He needs some tools. He's building a ranch house up at Beecher's Hope. Beecher's Hope? Okay. Have you got any, mate? Uh, okay. Like I said, an acquired taste, but a heart of gold, and he's the best. You off someplace, Nils? Okay. The dude probably barely speaks English. So Milton is uh, working with Cakes Hardwood and Timber in town. Should I get them to pay you and add it to his bill up there? Okay. Come on, let's get moving. Uh. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right then. Beecher's Hope. They've been trying to sell that property for some time, hadn't they? Took a look at it myself, as it so happens. Seemed like a lot of work. Too much for me. But more power to you. Must have seen something in it I couldn't. Yeah, I said that. He uses the best gun for hire, and he's always the first one to go. Damn it. Oh, shit. What the hell, man? Oh, fuck you, dude. Think so. There's more. They got the tools. They grab Mr. Wayne. All right, you stay here, guard the wagon. Charles, come on. Come and get me, you gruesome sons of bitches. Oh. Shit. Oh God, where are these assholes at? We walked into something. Get the cover. You mean? They threw us in! They're getting away with it! They climbed up in the trees! Shoot the ones up there first! Come on! This girl up there! Hide the tree! Where?
I really need to go to the gun store soon. Boy, the right the on top of what the hell happened? I didn't even do anything wrong, dumbass! Oh, come on! He wasn't that far, you stupid idiot! Can't win them all, can I? Okay, it makes the epilogue go. chapter He's so difficult. I found the tools. Now where's Mr. Carrying him? I got it. There's no use in you getting bloody, too. Is he. Is it. bad? They opened him up pretty good. He's dead. <sighs> Nearly chopped his head in two. God damn them! Uh huh. Mr. Wayne didn't make it. We have to get out of here. You take him in the back wagon. Come on. Help me. All right. Let's get out of here. I'm riding with you. Get us back to beaches. Those were the Skinner brothers. I told you I was worried. Sadie said something too. What kind of land have I bought? It's not the land. The Skinners move around. They're here for now. I thought this... This kind of bloodshed was meant to be over with. What was all the nonsense about civilization? This kind of bloodshed is different. Folks have been killed, sure. For good reason and bad. But rarely just for the fun of it. That was fun for them? No. Not that time. Most folk don't usually put up with such a fight. Then I hope we put an end to it. There was a caravan. A few months back, massacred. Uncle! 
Uncle! Uncle! I was... You useless sack of crap. I was keeping guard. Really? Whoa. What happened? Skinner Brothers. Bottom? Enough. Once this is done, I'll take Mr. Devon back to town. You pull Mr. Wayne buried. Okay. Be careful. Oh, I will. But I'm fairly sure we've scared him off for now. Bad business. Well, we'll be safe together. Sure. If you say so. This is going to lead into another Inshallah. mission, isn't it? I love you. Don't you forget that. box <sighs> ah well well shit well Morning. I tried but I failed hey there Charles well how you doing I'm fine well good take care John well I think that's the end of this video. I will see you next time.